Alhamdulillah. So, so if you remember this bed, um, I use this bed to grow those massive potatoes. If you haven't seen my potato harvesting video, go and check that out and, and you'll know what I'm talking about with massive potatoes. And I mean massive. But what I'm going to do today is I'm going to prepare this bed to plant my garlic. And the thing that I'm going to use to prepare this bed is I'm going to use my favourite tools from the garden. That's my chickens. The way this bed is, it's a raised bed on top of a raised bed. You see that massive mound of wood chips and compost and manure in the middle? That's where I grew the potatoes and on the edges is where I grew um, salad crops and stuff like that. Uh, things that I'm going to harvest regularly. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to set the chickens on here. Let them turn all that raised bed in the middle. Spread it all out for me. Uh, eat up any bugs that are in there. Eat up any weeds that are in there. Demolish them. And then this bed will be ready for me to plant my garlic. They'll aerate the soil. They'll poop in it and they'll uh, add fer fertility to it. But I can't just let the chickens go loose in the garden because I've still got plants that they'll, they'll scratch up. I've still got my cover crops growing. Um, if you haven't seen my cover crop video, go and check that out. That's packed full of information about cover crops. Go and, do go and check it out. It's a good time to start planting cover crops, just as a reminder. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to set my chickens. I'm going to um, pen them in on this bed and they'll work on this bed to prepare it for me. You've seen this before when I've done my chicken compost harvesting. It's just a roll of chicken wire that I've got some stakes in and I'm going to stake this into the bed. So we've got some kohlrabi here that, are still, um, that I've still got a chance of making it. I don't think they'll do much, but I don't want the chickens to completely demolish it. Because they will. They always do. I've started at the wrong corner, which is, as you can see, I should have started at this corner and you already penned this side in, that's a mistake. So let's try that again. There we go, that's a bit better. Time for the chickens. Now let's see if they behave. I think you need a dog for it. So I want to attempt to lure them using their chicken feed and see if they follow me. Come on. Come on, let's see if you behave. Mm -hmm. Anyone else? There's always one that two. you don't want to come down. Two. 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 It's, a, it's Harry Styles as well. There's a couple of chickens that don't want to do what we asked them to do. I've managed to get most of them in here. I'm going to leave them to do the work. I'm going to try and lock the other ones back up. <laughs> it's always Harry Styles. So now what those hens are going to do is they're going to they're going to scratch up. Let's go and have a look what they're doing already. See that they're all, they're already doing what we want them to do. So they're scratching about. They're digging. They're going to spread all that raised bed that's in the middle. And they'll kick that about everywhere. They'll just so in a few hours they'll completely demolish that. So I'm gonna leave them to it, and I'll come back in a few hours and check up on them, see what they're doing. Um, I mean, I've got to keep them penned up because I don't want them to ruin my other crops, and I need to protect them from foxes. At least this for a temporary time, it will act as a little bit of a deterrent. We're out here all the time anyway, so um, they should be okay. 
So just as I was hoping, um, the chickens have scratched about all this uh, bed. They've shifted a lot of it about. They've crumpled it quite up. You can see the difference between that there and and, and the bed that they've done. Now what I'm going to do, there you go. There, there's one of the hens busy at work. I mean, they will eat a lot of the worms, uh, but they'll also eat a lot of the other bugs as well. So she's she's quite busy. But they look a bit fed up, so I'm going to let them free. <laughs> yeah, they look a bit fed up. It's cold. I'm going to let them free. If this was a uh, during springtime, this this bed would probably be covered in my cover crops, and I'll show you what what a bed with cover crops looks like. There, there you go. So that's uh, mustard coming up. There's some clover in there. There's some broad beans in there as well. Um, and that's my bed with cover crops. That's the bed that I planted in the cover, cover crop planting, the green manure cover crop planting video. Go and check that out. It'll give you loads of information on the kind of, and you'll see the kind of mix that I've used as well. Um, so what I'm going to do with these chickens now is I'm going to take them back and put them back into their pen and let them, let them stay there. And I'll finish off raking, uh, raking this bed. And spreading this compost out and plant get starting on planting my garlic. So for this one, I'll leave it there. Assalamu alaikum warahmatullah.